Hey y'all, Rob here with ATX Legal, and today I'm excited to introduce Rian Butler. He's a personal injury attorney based here in Austin, Texas. I've worked directly with him on a couple of cases, and he's here to answer a number of common questions people have once they've been injured. Hey guys, I'm Rian Butler with the Rian Butler Law Firm. I'm here today to answer the question, how much is my personal injury case worth? This is one of the most common questions we get at, at initial intake and at a consultation. It's also one of the hardest ones to answer. Ultimately, the only person that can decide what a case is worth is a jury. 12 people randomly selected from the county or, or a portion of, of the state, and they have to decide what someone's case is worth. Obviously, with a jury comes a lot of risks, a lot of unknowns, and a lot of delay. It can take years to get in front of a jury. So from that, the lawyers have to make our best estimate of what a case might be worth and then figure out what the, the lack of those risks, the lack of the delay, might be worth as a reduction from that full value. The short answer is that a case can be worth a couple thousand to multi, multi millions of dollars. It all comes down to what's actually happened in the case. Uh, the three biggest factors relate to the person that's been injured. What are their injuries? What has their treatment been like to get there? And what are the policy limits available to recover for those injuries? In Texas, unfortunately, a lot of times people don't have any coverage at all. And so you're left with the uninsured motorist coverage you've purchased on your own policy. If someone does have coverage, the minimum limits in Texas are $30,000. Those can be gone in a matter of weeks, months, or, or even days from the medical bills that rack up when someone's injured. And then from there, there are people that buy more coverage that are more responsible and companies that have larger policies and companies that have uh, funds that you can go after directly aside from insurance. Aside from those factors, two cases that look very similar can wind up being much different. Two people with the same type of crash, the same type of injury, can have very different cases. Uh, different injuries can heal differently for, for different people. Two people might have the same herniation in their neck. One person gets better from a little physical therapy and rest. The other person doesn't and they wind up needing surgery. Those two cases are gonna be vastly different recoveries. Brain injuries are another big one. Brain injuries are very personalized. Uh, about 80% of people get better within a matter of months. And, and so those cases can be fairly simple to resolve. The 20% that don't get better right away can be devastating and, and lifelong injuries that wind up with complicated cases that could be worth a lot of money for a settlement because the injuries are so bad. Another big difference can be between the, the type of vehicle that hits you. Two people are hit by a large truck. One of them is driven by a, an individual that has a low policy limits insurance policy. The other one is driving for their work uh, that has a large commercial policy. So two cases that look at first glance very similar can wind up being very different there's a huge range of what a personal injury case can be worth. The only way to talk through these issues is to get a consultation with a personal injury lawyer. Consultations are free. My information's down below. Give me a call, shoot me a text, or give me an email. I'd be happy to talk with you.